Well, what should have been a fun trip to the Mustangs game for one young girl last night turned into a nightmare after she was struck in the head by a foul ball. Our David Jay talked with the family about the scary experience and found out she had one special visitor at the hospital this morning. A Billings girl is hit in the head with a foul ball at a Mustangs game. Quick work by the paramedics along with doctors and nurses helped her through the night and now she's home and recovering. The family is grateful to the emergency responders. A foul ball at the Mustangs game Wednesday night hit eight-year-old Serafina Moots in the head. So it was just a line drive down the third baseline um, and it just went straight into her head up here. Her grandpa was able to put his glove up a little bit to kind of deflect it from hitting her straight on, um, which helped then because it just kind of then grazed the side of her head there. Doctors and nurses checked on her through the night and early morning and released her Thursday. She has a 5.8 millimeter little blood spot on her upper right side of her brain in there. If it would have been eight millimeters or above, we would have been sent to Salt Lake. The Moots family appreciates the medical help and the support. The staff at the hospital and Becky, the EMT, top notch. Couldn't ask for anything better in this, in this community. Just incredible people. Serafina's grandfather contacted EMT Becky Biggins, who visited and read to her in the hospital. Normally we would give them the, the book bag right in the incident or right after. Um, Becky kind of went above and beyond for this one, which was pretty cool. It's all part of the Billings Fire Department's book bag program. It's designed to uh, kind of help them through a stressful time and comfort them. What do you think of Becky? Awesome. Yeah, yeah, Becky is awesome, isn't she? Serafina's grandpa and her dad always bring baseball mitts to the games for safety. Many major and minor league ballparks started extending netting a few years ago. That varies from ballpark to ballpark, and the city of Billings installed netting when Dealer Park was built in 2008. And Grandpa Ron Spence has new plans for season tickets next season. Grandpa says he's going to put buy seats behind the netting net <laughs> from now on. They will watch her closely for a couple of days and say Serafina will be fine for the third grade in the fall. She's got quite the story to tell when she goes back to school. <laughs> in Billings, David J, MTN News.